Vector files are extremely versatile. They're scalable, and they don't lose their resolution no matter how much you resize them. If you have Adobe Illustrator, here's how to easily convert PNG files to vector using the program. First, open the image that you want to convert in Illustrator. To do so, open Illustrator. Next, click on File from the top right, then click on Place and navigate to your file's location. Simply open the file to import it to Illustrator. Once you're done, select the image using the Select tool, then click on Window from the options above. From the drop-down options, click on Image Trace. From the Image Trace window, choose your preferred mode. This will depend if you have a colored picture or a black and white image. You may also need to adjust the threshold depending on what image you're tracing. You can choose to turn on the Preview option from the bottom to see your current setting. Once you're satisfied with the tracing, you can uncheck Preview, then click on Trace, and that's basically already a vector image. However, if your image has a background, you need to do some additional steps to remove it. With your image selected, click on Object from the top, then select Expand. Simply click OK on the pop-up window. Next, click Object once again, then select Ungroup. Once you're done, click Object a third time, then choose Ungroup again. Basically, you need to ungroup Group the image twice. Now click anywhere on the screen to deselect your whole image. Next, click on the background, then press delete. Now you can try resizing the image. Once you're satisfied, you can save your file. Simply go to File, then select Save As. Make sure to select the formats AI, EPS, or SVG. And that's basically how it's done. If this video helped you out, make sure to like and subscribe to watch other guides about all sorts of technology. Also, check out our other videos that we think you'll like.